Hey, good afternoon, morning, uh, whatever it is to everybody. How y'all doing? Uh, this your boy Rod Thomas Jr. from the Real New Behind the News. Uh, just want to thank all the new subscribers to our page, man. Um, we we got a lot of things. We got a couple of videos that we want to upload a little bit later on today, uh, talking about local issues here in Shreveport. Whereas we had um, last night, they had arrested three guys in the murder of a police officer uh, here locally in Shreveport. We also want to talk about the, uh, the government shutdown. Uh, those of you all, uh, those people who are receiving SNAP benefits will get your benefits early here in Louisiana. You'll get them actually by this Sunday. Also, we want to talk about international issues. So there's going to be about three or four videos that we're going to be doing a little bit later. Also, we're trying to figure out how we can um, set up this thing uh, you know, to uh, provide you all with better uh, video, <laughs> audio, and, and what have you not. But again, we thank you all for supporting us, uh, those who have recently subscribed. Uh, what we do here at The Real News Behind the News is more than just put out YouTube videos. We actually here locally in our city engage the political process. Um, we have um, connections with pretty much all the politicians here in the city. So we actually are a grassroots uh, organization that actually knows what the political process here, locally, state, and nationally, is all about. But we also get out and fight for the uh, elderly and the children um, in a lot of cases. But also we just fight for the people who don't know how to fight, don't know what the fight is all about. We just try to be a voice for the voiceless. And again... Um, this is what we do. So when you see us doing these uh, YouTube videos, it's just it's not just some black dude sitting up here talking on YouTube. No, we actually engage and speak out to power, but we engage the social situations here. We're not social justice warriors, but we do believe in standing up for what's right. And um, again, being a voice for those who, are, who feel like they have no voice. So again, y'all... Uh, uh, stay tuned today after I finish up this little uh, this little bit of job that I got going on. Uh, we're going to upload two or three videos talking about what's going on here locally. We're going to talk about what's going on here uh, nationally and internationally. I will give y'all a hint on national issues. It's crazy that your government is basically in a shutdown, but the first bill that of the year that the Senate tried to pass is something... Uh, basically taking away your constitutional right to boycott uh, Israel or to even speak out against Israel. Man, them, them folks tried to pass that bill three times just last, what, twice last week. And then um, I think it's Mitch McConnell is trying to bring it up again. With all the stuff going on here in America, man, why are we, why are you, I mean, again, think about it. Let me just say this to them ago. In that bill that they tried to pass twice last week, which is unprecedented, you don't have them to bring a bill for a Tuesday and it get turned down and they vote again on it Thursday. No, that don't happen. There's a lot of money being put up to force this bill to be uh, voted on in Congress. But with all the stuff that's going on, Donald Trump has and the Democrats are acting like children and got your government shut down behind $5 billion for a wall. But in that bill they was trying to pass last week, they trying to give Israel thirty-eight billion. Why did I just take ten billion out that thirty-eight that y'all talking about getting Israel to build a wall? Why are you shutting the government down? Now, um, one of our videos that went viral and that really put us on the map, we, we talked about SNAP and EBT. But it's deeper than that. You got federal workers now who are working and not getting paid eventually if the government uh, once it opens back up for business they'll get paid but what if they get kicked out of their houses so it's bigger than just snap uh, food stamps it's bigger than just uh, you know uh, a wall this is about political posturing but anyway I said I, I, I gotta go I gotta go finish this uh, this job up, up the street man but um, y'all y'all follow the real new behind you thank you if you like this video you know what I'm saying Hit the thumbs up if you don't like it. You're probably going to hit thumbs down. But either way it goes, subscribe. Because I don't expect everybody to agree with everything that I say. But my whole objective is not to get you to believe what I say. But at least to question and challenge 
what is being told to you by the mainstream media. So y'all give us a second. We finna um, go finish this up. Then we're gonna come back and we're gonna start uploading those videos. It takes us a little long because we the broke version of the new. And we're doing everything right now through a cell phone, a cheap cell phone at that. But hey, we still bringing you the real new behind the new. Hey, rest in peace, Boogie, man. I just lost my cousin yesterday. Um, to my family, y'all, hey, be strong. I got y'all back. Hey, y'all be blessed now.